In today's hyper-digital world, where our lives are connected in more ways than one, the need to discover hidden relationships and secret connections is not reserved to private investigators or crime-fighting superheroes. The age of technology has brought information to our fingertips in an unprecedented way. With the vast world of the internet, tools and methods are readily available that provide the ability to trace and track connections that were once veiled in secrecy. This exploration doesn't need a background in law enforcement. In fact, anyone with an internet connection and a curious mind can step into the shoes of a digital investigator, unlearning hidden links, associations, and networks. So let me show you how. It's crucial to remember that this process should always be conducted responsibly and ethically. The goal isn't to invade privacy or spread misinformation, but rather to gain a deeper understanding of the intricate web of connections that shapes our world. Now let's dive into an amazing tool that can find people's secret connections. The tool that makes this possible is Maltego. Maltego is a data mining tool that mines a variety of data sources building interactive graphs that visually shows relationships and real-world links between pieces of information. So let's jump right into it. This is the Maltego interface. It may be look daunting at first, but once you get the hang of it, it's incredibly powerful. To begin, we'll start a new project. Give it a name relevant to your investigation. On the Multego interface, you'll come across the term entities. Entities in the context of Multego are crucial building blocks that aid your investigation. They are essentially elements that you can add to your graph to represent the various components of your research. Think of entities as characters in your digital investigation story. Each has its unique identity and role to play. For example, if you're looking into the connections between individuals in a company, your entities could include person for the individuals, company for the organization, and email for the professional email addresses. Maltego offers a wide variety of predefined entities ranging from websites to phone number and social network. Once you add entities to your graph, you can then run transforms on them, which are powerful tools to probe data sources and draw meaningful connections. Now, let's look at a specific example. Start by adding three person entities to the graph, one for each individual you're investigating, Jeffrey Epstein, Elon Musk, and Bill Gates. Now you're ready to run some transforms on those entities. One transform I like is the Little Sis transform. This transform exposes who knows who in the world of business and government. This will potentially uncover any companies they are or were associated with. You can find all kinds of connections. We can, for instance, see how much Bill Gates donated to a specific person for a campaign. Review the resulting graph to see if any shared connections appear. For instance, let's say hypothetically the transforms reveal a connection between a company to both Elon Musk and Bill Gates. Continue this process, running transforms and analyzing the results. If at any point you find a link to Jeffrey Epstein, you have discovered a connection. Remember, the aim of using Maltego is not to violate privacy or spread misinformation, but rather to uncover public, factual data points that may reveal relationships between entities. After running transforms, you'll see a graph that represents connections. This might include connections between people, organizations, websites, social net profiles, and more. Understanding this graph is key. The dots or nodes represent entities and the lines or edges represent the connections between them. This was a basic demo on how to use Maltego to discover hidden connections. Remember, this tool is powerful and should be used responsibly. Respect privacy and always operate within legal limits. Thank you for joining us. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this in the future.